to a regularly scheduled program. Hi, welcome back to my channel. If you don't know me, my name is Christina and I put out videos every Saturday. So if you want to get notified for when I post, hit subscribe. Question of the day, what is your favorite dessert to bake or just eat in general? Uh, mine is brownies. What's yours? Ooh, that's rice, a tough pudding. One. rice pudding. Rice pudding. Yeah, yeah, rice pudding yeah. is okay, my favorite so dessert. Brownies. Brownies yeah. and rice puddings. Today we have my sister again, Carly. Hola. <laughs> um, and today we are going to be baking chocolate chip cookies, well, gluten-free chocolate chip cookies. First we need our ingredients, so let's just go get them and start baking. Oh, we didn't even say that. That was weird. Okay, so we're gonna start. We got our ingredients. We got, let's see what we got. We got our butter. Where's our butter? We got butter. We got milk, almond milk, because that's way more better. Don't drink actual milk, terrible. Uh, brown sugar, we have brown sugar, and our white sugar, because we're, we're inclusive. Um, one egg. One egg. Vanilla, because that's always important. We have flour, gluten-free flour, for those of you who want to know what kind of flour we use. King's Arthur gluten-free flour. We have baking soda and baking powder. Nope, just baking soda, I lied. Uh, then we're using Himalayan salt because we're healthy. And chocolate chips. Better than table scores. Okay, so we're gonna kill two birds with one stone. Carly's gonna do work on the dry stuff while I work on the wet stuff. Just to clarify, what I'm doing right now is melting the butter in a saucepan. And then once it's melted, I'm gonna whisk it. And then it'll like start to brown on the bottom and give off a nutty aroma. That's what it says. And then... I'm gonna transfer it to a mixing bowl. Not a mixing bowl, just a glass bowl, but. Mm -hmm. What I'm doing is I'm gonna be doing the dry ingredients. So that's a little, pretty much, yeah. The flour, baking soda, and salt. Got the butter right here. After it's been then cooked or whatever, <laughs> we need to add the milk, brown sugar, and white sugar. Oh, it smells so good. What it That's wet. what the wet ingredients looks what? like. 350. And then we gotta pour it in the dry ingredients. Okay, ready? Do you wanna do the mixing while I do the pouring? Sure. I'll bring it closer. Oh, I see. Okay, time to plate. No, what is it called? <laughs> Put on the pan. Look at this deliciousness. That looks so good. Let's get shaking, bacon. You should start learning how to make naked cakes now because naked cakes? Is it you want yeah. a three tier cake? I don't know. I don't know if I want two or three. I want three. <laughs> Probably three. Oh. <laughs> Love that. It was like... <laughs> it's like the chocolate chips are like sliding out. Get in there. Let's get in there. Okay, so after 
We put it onto the tray. We're gonna bake them for 10 to 12 minutes and then eat them because that's why we're baking them. Here's our station. That's not gonna be a cute cookie. <laughs> it's gonna be like a thumbprint cookie. They look so cute. Oh my gosh. <laughs> look at that what one right there. That? I'm so sorry. But the rest look really good. <laughs> that cookie has a belly button. Do you, want to pierce, do you want to pierce it? A what? It's very important to clean up your station during and after. Yes. So this is the before. Baking is my favorite thing to do whenever, honestly, like when I'm feeling sad or when I'm feeling happy, then I just love to bake. It's so fun. It's really so fun. I just hate cleaning up. It's so annoying. I felt that. <laughs> also part. Okay, so the cookies are done and I'm going to plate them and then put this next batch on it. Let's do it. Oh, hi. Hi. <laughs> look, they look so good. Oh, look at the lighting. They look so perfect sitting there in their brown and That cookie said chocolate chip fell off. Ah. Oh, oh sad. no! Billy Bob Bob Billy. Okay. Billy Bob Bobby. I want that cookie. Last one. The one with lots okay. of chocolate chips. Time for more! Time for more! Let's dish her up. Okay, here they are. Second batch going in right now. Okay, so here's our plate of cookies and we're gonna taste test we're gonna for eat you. <laughs> Which one do I want? I want a little baby one for you. I have one with a lot of tattoos. They're soft. At first it tasted like salty. But I, then I fully tasted it and it's- Oh wow, these are actually the best cookies, chocolate chip cookie, cookies, I can't- Cause it's not all soft. These are like the best chocolate chip cookies I've ever made. I'm gonna have another, another one. Oh, they're hungry. These are so good. Look, I'm gonna see it cause of the lighting. Look how it pulls apart. Oh, we oh, love showing God. the audience how soft it is. Hang on. <laughs> Oh, it's like a little Christmas tree. Oh, it's not. <laughs> not even. No, it's not. It's so <laughs> ugly. You get the point. Actually, like, it's just a plant. No, that's definitely not a Christmas tree. I end the video like, ah, this <laughs> Second batch, baby. Look at those goodies. Oh my gosh. Hi. This is my third one. Don't tell Carly. The third and final batch is completed. Thank you for joining me on this journey. Um, my sister and I. Let's put this bad boy 
Wow, they look so beautiful. I'm so proud. Oh, this is good. The cookies are being put away for another time. So that's all I have for you guys today. I hope you enjoyed it. And if you did, make sure to like and comment. And don't forget to follow me on all my social media. And I will tag Carly's social media down below as well. And I will also link down the recipe that we made if you guys want to make some gluten-free cookies, you know. And of course, always remember to stay strong. Bye.